What's up gamer students, it is I, the Epic Game Wizard, and welcome to part 3 of my favorite game, Super Paper Mario. I did say I was going to do this late at night, but we're doing this earlier, because I love this game. Okay, anyway, let's get started. Where we left off. Okay, so, we're about to put the third heart into the pillar. <clears throat> also, if you guys like this video, make sure you like, subscribe, and turn on all notifications so you cannot forget one of my channels being uploaded. My second one is still being uploaded, but pretty soon, after this video might be over, it might be up. So be in touch with that. Honestly, I didn't read you guys' comments because, obviously, again, the video's not finished yet. So, these bricks right here, you need Boomer. Because obviously you can't, like, go underneath the pipe and hit it. Look at these spring dudes again. Ow. Ow. Okay, and you see that? That's where the third one is. But you may be thinking, how do we get in there? Oh, no, wrong button, wrong button. How do we get in there? Well, you remember that guy said slim to thin cracks? That's how we do it. Boom, third heart pillow. In less than two minutes. Yeah! Okay, here we go, chapter 3. The yellow door. Do it like last time for the other chapters. Use the warp pipe. Let's go back to the tower quickly. Okay, we don't need you. We need like someone like this one. So, for real? I don't know how to say it. Chapter three, guys. Let's go. Mario and his new friends opened the door, unsure of what they would find. All the while, Merle's words about finding the other two heroes ring in their minds. Were these other heroes somewhere in this new world? If not, where? Meanwhile, the creeping void grew larger in the skies above Flipside. The hopes of all worlds rested in the heroes finding the next pure heart. And it's cold. Chapter 3-1 When Geeks Attack What? <laughs> Why do they name a chapter like that? Ah, 8 bits. My favorite bits. So, <clears throat> so, this is where the door leads. I suppose the pure heart might be nearby. That's hard. I feel it, I can feel it nearby. But where could it be? Well, I act. <laughs> Hi, technical. I got a super real pixelated butterfly. <laughs> My friends, <laughs> the butter butterfly going to freak out when they word get word of this fine. <laughs> I must bring it home. I can't miss this week's episode of the Grotters. Chronic. What? Chronicles? 
No way I'm going to entrust my additional record, record of meow to tape an episode so epic. <laughs> this is so high technical. <laughs> Well, he was confused. Whoa, ho, ho. Whoa, ho, whoa, ho, ho. A kidnapping? Oh, the despair. Oh, the despair. Awful spectacle of all, of it all. The shocking scene occurred right before my very own tender eyes. Well, I guess now that's a war for a pixel. Now that, that, Freak Francis has got her. Hello, Bush? Whoa, ho. Ooh. Who's this guy? A friend of the butterfly girl that got nabbed? Well, that's a pity. That geek just grabbed her, Francis, grabbed her. Francis, basically, the nerd to end all nerds. Plus, you got a thing with butterflies, and, well, things nerdy, too. If he gets his sweaty mitts on something he likes, there's no gain it back. He collects stuff and keeps it in his big fantasy fortress. It's like geek paradise. Whoa, now! You want to know where Fort Francis is? Well, if you collect all, if you go all the way down here ahead for miles and miles, you will find it. You will find it. I'm thinking of infiltrating that nerd Leo and rescuing her. Are you? Look, nobody likes having their butterfly kidnapped by a geek, but it's dangerous. Still set on it, eh? What a tender moment. I think I got something in my eye here. Listen, let me give you some travel tips. You listening? Good. All I got for you is three critical tips, so remember all of them. Here's your first tip. A bunch of no-class jerks are holed up in a castle up ahead. It ain't gonna be easy past them, but here's the juice. It's an old castle. You do your thing with that red next X near and maybe something will happen for you. Now, for my second tip. If you somehow pass those clowns in the castle, you'll see an ocean. Can't miss it. A scary sea monster lives here. There. The beast is huge! That's what she says. And cranky. But, if you toast this red flipper thing something, good is bound to happen. And here's the last tip. Once you swim your way through the ocean, you'll see a enormous tree. There's a huge gorge on the other side. There's no jumping across it. Look for the red, red wind and something with it. And do something with it. Then you can get across. See all that? Good. You be careful now. If by some crazy chance you do save her, come back and tell me how you did it. Those are tips on the whole chapter. Well, this chapter through... Ooh, Tilly. Why you say? Do I get double the power defense? Okay. Oh, uh, safe file. Here we go. I think this is just an optional thing. I think it's optional up here. I don't know. I don't know. Let's go through it, guys. Oh, there's a catch call over there. Ow! 
actually, so I can't deal with him, but wait, unless... Eat that because I really need some help. Is it uh, those squishy plucks? No. Ooh, we actually finally kill him. Ooh, maybe we need Peach. Oh, that works. Oh man. Jump to a uh, jump over it. Yes, this is optional. I don't have to do it, but I want to anyways. If you use Peach in this little tiny background area, it makes it easier to travel across the mountains. Oh, the catch part is super. What's useless? Battles enemies on the ground and ceiling. Actually, it might be useful. Um. Ah, let's just sacrifice the peach. I can. Goodbye, peach. Peach throwing out a peach. <laughs> ah, that's funny. No, that's not. No, there's nothing you can. Do you think you can just enter that pipe if you're in the background? No, of course not. Okay, here we go. Oh, big boy time. Or girl, if you're playing as Peach. I do like how they made the art. They reused the art from Super Mario Bros. Okay, let's go in this door. What is it? It's a Koopa. What's he doing? Wait, that's illegal. Oh no, don't do that. Oh no! That happens every time you enter that room. A Koopa will take a star from that block right there. You have to run all the way back and grab one. Right? And then you just touch him and he's dead. And then all you just do is kill all of his friends. I think there's somebody down here. Fall in between the red pipes. I do get a bit of points by doing that. I didn't even realize that. Oh 
know. Just stick with Peace for a while, cause her ability might come in use. Now obviously that's a hint and I uh, completely missed that hype right there. Someone right here, right? Yep, here we go. Secrets! Ah, oh, no, I ain't choosing to pick a pipe. Ah, oh, heck, nah, I ain't choosing no pick a pipe yet. I don't feel like it. Also, that's the between the red pipe thing. Also, I'm gonna use a cash card. It didn't work, okay. Man, this really does feel like Pokemon. Give me the Kamek! Thank you. Magic Koopa, I don't care, I'm calling it Kamek. That's the name for the Cam. that's the name for Magic Koopa, Kamek. Oh, and also watch out for that black thing. It takes you back to flip side. So, um, can't do like that. That is useless, don't grab that, don't eat it. Actually, it might have a use, I don't know. It's a poison mushroom. And you know what poison mushrooms do to you? You get poisoned. Oh, uh, that's a blue version of one of those things. What's my... Oh, I don't have Tippy. Why am I doing? Thunder Rage. Where is the... I think this is original. Oh, no, that's the... Up. I think I got the original. Yep, there we go. You can use Thunder Rage, obviously. If you just wait for him to make more and more clones of himself, it's a good way to get some sweet, sweet XP. I think, uh, yeah, you can stand on the grass. Kind of weird. You stand on the grass and the uh, flowers. Okay, ice. You can say these items may come in handy later down this ch part of this chapter. Okay, and you gotta obviously jump down there, but you can't jump up there. I think there's a way you can get up there. Other than using the magic cooper. So, yeah, these are... Oh, that's blue. Blue's doing some squats? Oh, uh, and there's actually an item up there, okay. Okay, you want to be Peach, so you can at least glide safely. There you go. Chest, what do we get? We get... A Piranha Plant card, not bad. Now, like it says, jump down between these two red pipes. And you got World One Dash Two, another Mario Bros. reference. Oh, and there's the Pal Pills again. So more XP and troops to help you out, dude. Maybe a horn. Oh. Uh, I think I messed myself up there. Now, okay, you see how many coins there are? 
flip to Mario. Uh, will it still flip to Mario? Okay, we got another capture card SP. Um, let's just drop it down. Yeah, I need the cake mix. The cake mix you can randomly get from Goombas. Mario with two peaches. Ow! Did they jump down with me? Oh, look at this Goomba. Okay, never mind, the Goomba's dead. Okay, that's just a secret area you can just do, but it's not optional, it's not, it is optional. Okay, let's see what, um, no, we're going left to right. Getting number one, coin. Getting number two, another coin. Getting three, ah, blue mushroom, 20 HP. Getting number three, another coin. Getting number four. Every one of those, except for the third one, sucks. Wait. It's a lie. Oh, nice shapes, man. Wait, those are the shapes that they wear when they're on Team Count Black. Alrighty, and this is where um, 2-1 in, but here's a the thing. There's a secret in Super Mario Bros. where if you jump over it, you go to this area. Remember this area? That pipe right there? Yeah. Um, forget about it. I think this goes through. Wait, hold on, hold on. Nope, 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 no, no, go back, go back. Ah, oh, frick. Well, time to run back. Oh, come here. Come here. Come here. Actually, no, give me your, give me your soul. Okay, me. Fine then. I'm mine. Oh, nice. Okay, I need to go back. Yeah, that's what happens. You can take this pipe. Okay, anyways, let's return back to this because I didn't realize the middle pipe take me a bit further down the road. Oh wait, I think... I think you're supposed to be 3D, actually, doesn't matter. We get a Magic Koopa card, which we already have. Now, if you saw the flower fit, the infinite coin, food, and um, XP form in the same chapter video, obviously, I always get duplicate. If I ever get duplicate cards, I just sell them. But in this one, I'm not gonna sell them. So if I ever get a, wait, give me that. Ow. Alt. Yeah, you. This is Bowser's castle. And his brutaliness doesn't like chumps like you kicking up the place. You're about to get a com com complimentary nose job courtesy on my shell. Come on out, fellas! Yeah! 
Come and get some. You won't hit a girl, won't you? No, I'm joking. Get some! The heck? Hold a bell? Give me that. I just grabbed the whole cannon? Nope! I can- I can return to send it. Oh, I can. Oh, I think I- Hold on, let me try this. Working? No. Oh, wait, hold on. I think I might know how to defeat this. There we go. X marked the spot, but there's a crack. I wonder what you do. Actually, hold on. Let's peek. Peach. This bounce castle. Let's have Peach destroy it. Yeehaw! Hey, it's Bowser. Bugs! Please tell me someone didn't just blow up my awesome lair. Don't even know this is Bowser's voice. Hey! I know that stats from somewhere. Mario! And Princess Peach! No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Why do you always have to do that? That's like the hundredth time you show up at my castle and screw everything up. Bug! But now you enter a fortress of pain, Mario. No more sequels. It's gonna end right here, right now, once and for all. A level up. Oh, I didn't realize he can do that. Oh, fine. Welcome to the Bowser fight, and if you get to Ice Storm with Thunder Rage, you can do this. Okay. Oh, no mind. And now use your Thunder Rage. Bam. Oh, I hate Mario. It's not fair. Mario. Are you okay? Ah, Princess Peach. My lovely wife. Your wife? What? Are you kidding me? How did you forget our big day? The thing I skip, it's the wedding. That sham was not a wedding. What are you doing here anyways, Bowser? How should I know? I was locked up in Count Black's stupid castle. And all of a sudden, bam! Me and my minions wake up face down in this field. Then we found this awesome castle, and I thought, why not make myself a lamb? Well, you see, Bowser, we really need your help. Why don't you come with us? Wait, what? Black got, Black got us married just to make a chaos heart so that he could destroy the world? Yes, and that's why we need you to help us find the pure hearts. No, I wanna. I think about... I think about if, if it was for you, but there's no way I'm helping Mario. We don't have to. We don't have time for this. For you. We don't have... <laughs> we don't have time for you to be a big baby about this. Come on, Bowser. Please? But... But I'm Bowser. I'm grade 8. 100% prime cut. Final boss. I'm gonna take over the world any day now. No way, I'm helping Mario. I'm always trashing he. Uh, he's always trashing my awesome plans. Please? For me? For me? 
No! I wanna. What you say? If the world ends, there's not gonna be any world for me to rule? Ah, more you think good. And what will happen to your poor minions who were caught by Count Black? They've been brainwashed and now do his evil bidding and not your evil bidding. Now your minions have now your minions will have to toil on a, a different cruel and merciless master. But but why you Mmm Why Fine! I'll join your stupid quest if you're happy. Oh, thank you, Bowser. You're so sweet. No, I am not sweet. And I'm not helping Mario just to save a bunch of worlds. I'm only doing it so I can rule something. So don't get cuddly with me, Mario. That's right, Bowser. You big sweetie. Oh, goodness. That's pretty sus, Peach. Bowser, join your party. The best character in this game. When controlling Bowser, press down on the T-pad to breathe your fire on your enemies. His breath is furious, so it may drop any. So I'm. So use it to drop any enemies that stand in your way. Lord Bowser! Your crabbiness. Are you leaving us? What? Oh, yeah. Minions! Hold down the fort until I return. Your lair is safe with us, sir. Oh, sir, it seems that Count Black has brainwashed some of your loyal hench people. They're probably going to be forced to attack you, so feel free to dull our punishment. Yeah, of, of course. We love to come along to defend you, but, you know, we just, uh, get in the way. Yeah. Hentious, hentiousness? Clobber the count with us. Clobber that count for us. Yeah. Anyway, anyone who wears a cape and monocle is just begging for a beating. Long live King Bowser. Why do I get a Lion King reference? I was gonna say long live the king. Long live King Bowser! We'll miss you, you showiness. Party! Oh, you guys. Fine, come on. Let's get your stupid precious heart. Or whatever you call it. I said move it! Now, look at that. Bowser does double attack, uh, double the amount of damage. Also, he walks slowly. Okay. So, this is your third unlockable character, Bowser. My favorite one, because first off, he can breathe fire, does double amount of damage. The downside walks very slowly and has a big hitbox. With Bowser and the party, the three heroes made a most unlikely trio. Peach attempt to uh, uh, explain the quest to Bowser, but it made him grunt in confusion. As Mario walked ahead, he spotted something that made him briefly stop and stare. What is it, Mario? asked Peach as she turned to see a bunch of blue expanse ahead. The great glittering waves of the tile pool stretched as far as she could see. Fort Francis is somewhere across the water. Chapter 3 2! Oh my goodness, it's getting colder in here. Loops ahoy! The tile pool. This is my favorite part of Bowser. First off, his arms are literally not supposed to be like that. But you can just breathe any time you like to underwater. Mmm, bloopers. Five bloopers. Okay, I was gonna say, do I have to? Oh, it's one of those flower things. Nah, no, I ain't worried about that. 
You can go through there or you can just take this route. Not, not about the thing, we not. Okay. Killing all Bowser's minions, which is what you want. Pegs. Okay, we need to find a way how to get those down. Ah, safe block, finally. Okay, let me guess we switch to Mario. Yes, sir, we. It's like an object, optical illusion. And I love games with optical illusion. Okay, and I'll switch back to Bowser because I was like. Bowser can be good here. You see those? Let's use him. Also, watch out for these twirly twirlies. Nah, nah. Let's save that for later. Actually, nah, nah, nah. Let's go up. Does it speed up the process? Okay, these flippers. That's not a pun, I'm telling you that. I'm just saying like flippers like they flip with Mario. Alrighty, um here we go. I am way of trap. But not through thread. Just use Bowser in this one. I think you have to anyways. Because I think there's no way you can um hack these guys. Ooh, a catch card. Oh, I can just imagine just landing on that. And I will just collect it. Oh boy, oh boy. I wonder what this big chest has inside. We see this like three times. Hey. In case you're heard, I throw a lot of girth around these parts. And I'm gonna check you to make sure you're the guy that you got the way to hang with it. Alright, let's start by checking that face of yours. Dude, has shaggy eyebrows. That's not even kind of girthy. I'll give it 50 girth points. Alright, I'm gonna check out the girthiness of those clothes of yours. What's more girthier than a giant spiny shell? That's worth 100 girth points. Wait, do they say something else if I play as like Mario or Peach? Good. Check out that body coming up. That's where the real heavy comes from. Look at this guy. Look him up in the dictionary, and he's the definition of good. <laughs> a super hate, a super heavy weight right here. Bam! Ten thousand good points. That's your good attitude on my display here is blowing my mind. There's no gain around it. You got heavy like I've never seen before. Any fool that gets in your way, you just have to girth them up. By him. Not them. Girth him up. Love it. Smash and squish those lightweights. They're gonna place with girth. Like that. I wanna come along for the ride. Get Thudley. A ground pounding pixel, pixel named Thudley joins you. Now you can unleash a powerful attack on anything right before, right below with you when you jump. You can even use the ground pound on enemies underwater. 
with our girth combined, nobody can stop us. Now, you gotta get out of this room first, put my heavyweight power to work. With the power of girth, anything can happen. Also, I'm gonna be a different character, let's be Peach. <laughs> That's a weird ground pound. The last thing you see, getting stomped on by Peach. Actually, that's just weird now. Yeah, okay, we got Mr. Guth, man. That's pretty good for you. That's like a sassy boy version now. I don't know how I did it. Get out of here. Don't touch me. Look good. We have tentacle arm. Watch out for the whirly twirlies. And here's the puzzle. There's a drawing of a post on the wall, from left, from left to right, up, down, down. She looks up, down, down, up, down, up. So, just remember that, you can just remember one of them, which I'm going to remember the bottom ones. Two, three, four, five. So I'm going to be Mario and just... Oh, I never see this in 3D before. The Whirly Twirlies are also in 3D. Wait, there's something up here. One million good points. And now do ground pound these pegs in the ground. I don't think I ever tried that before. I never ground pounded on an enemy underwater. Okay, and I'm gonna play Bowser because obviously you do need to use him pretty soon later down this. Because remember one of the tips? Fire breathing on tentacle arms. Okay. Uh, now we have these real robotic fish. Let's try to use a catch one though. I want to catch one of them. That's a fail. I think these are Francis's. I think these are Francis robots. Okay. Blue. <laughs> blue blue. What's going on? This is on. <laughs> that was his arms. Oh, what's going on here? I don't like this. Giant. Ah, Squid Games. Ah, Squid Games. Bloop. 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 Hey, Leon Freak, how much do you, how much do you like the tentacle sandwich? That's sus. 
That's pretty sus, man, not gonna lie. And this is what you do. You just swim as Bowser, breathe on tentacles. Breathe fire on tentacles. Oh, you can, I think you can... I never tried ground pound on them. And if you see this red one, it does damage to him. Blah, bloop. Bloop, 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 bloop. No, not there. Please, anywhere but there. Oh, no matter, it still does damage to him. There's no way that you uh, actually he trapped you like this. Blue, blue. <laughs> Bowser just swims away. We kill a giant squid. Uncle Ben, what happened? Squid games. I realized it. No, no, no. I think that's what that's what happens if you uh, switch characters while in 3D. You can't be in 3D with the characters that you like and love. Say what, hon? You always want to use Mario everywhere to check every nook, crannies. You don't know what else. There's a that's a big tree in the background. Be Bowser. Bowser's cool. Bowser's awesome. We got. We got that girth. Bowser got that girth. Hashtag Bowser girth. Somehow the heroes have beached the big blooper and crossed the tide pool. Tile pool. But before they can dry, they saw something imposing. Sith Hall. Sith Hall of Fort Francis. It sure's getting dark, Peach said in a quiet voice. But when they look up, they realize they were in the shadow of the huge tree. Mario knowing in his gut there must be a way set out towards that giant tree. That giant tree. 3-3! Three, three. Up, up, and a tree. Yo, man. This tree has more weight than you. It has 10 million girth points. Now, if you see this little tiny house right here, you can't enter it until you get a pixel character to shrink you later down the game. This tree has 10 million good points. Is this new master now? Come here, boy. I'm gonna turn you into fried turtle. Oh, goodness. Not. I don't care. Oh. Dried shroom. I, uh. They're useless, so might as well eat it. Oh, these guys. He's rubbing his head on my spikes, and he's still not. Oh no, we're doing all the time mode. Yeah, that old chunk junk noise. Oh, that's actually useful. Ow! 
I like to call that princess abuse. I hereby punish you. You need that good power. I like that transcension. I like that transition. Do you have the power of girth? Okay. You look like you have the girth powers within you. Should take me to uh, okay, within the tree. I gotta be more coins than that, buddy. I thought I smelled a rat. There we go. And we're about to teach because she can be useful in some small gappy area, long gap areas, I mean. Don't abuse the princess! Oh no. The store is covered in dry bark. It's sealed shut. That's one of them daisies I show you in the tutorial, but that's not the correct one. Also, there's a safe fire, but before we do that, change colors. Take my progress, thank you. Ah, yes, the iconic red blue. Also, now you see platforms. So you have to use those um, switches. Probably not a good idea to use. Bowser, if I'm gonna get hit. Yeah, Peach actually might be useful for this. Nope. Ladder! Also, I'm going to show you what happens when you use Bowser on ladder. Can't climb this. What? I never seen that happen. Oh, because I kill these guys. Got that one million good point. Oh, now mind, now he's back on track. Do you got the girth?
Well, the beach is annihilating these flowers. That's the wrong character. Oh. Okay, for this area, you get to use some um, slim. Just play safe. Don't get greedy. And now you just switch colors. And obviously if you get hit, you just go all the way back to the right side. It's not like, oh, you can get hit and you can go all the way back to the actual beginning which if so then that would just be a time save oh, I think you can get an excellent off these things never mind my thing doesn't want to do it Okay, drop Boomba down here, and then you do it again, but this time don't immediately explode it, then you immediately explode it. Aha! Ching Chomp. I just burned him. I never realized Bowser can... There we go. Peach 2 card. Do you got the girth in you, brother? I don't know why I keep doing that voice now. What's this? Ah, it's this one. No, 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 you are not going to know. I didn't even know what to do for this puzzle, but now I just realized, and it doesn't make sense, but you just use Slim. And now go to Boomer. And then go back to Slim. What you just saw there is a stupid move I did. Don't do what I just did there, or you have to record a longer video than you have to.
Ah, criminy Chrysler. Actually, I could just have one and two for a quick switch. Ooh, I actually didn't realize. Can I try that? Oh my goodness, I didn't realize that's a thing you can do. All I can use is slim. Alright, now I think we're back where we are, okay. And we're finally at the switch, the actual blue switch, which makes that. And now all you just have to do is just get this. Thank you, uh, hold on. Not too far down. And now, once you've completed all of that, make sure you save. I'm gonna be Bowser again. Finally, you arrive. Oh, it's Dementio. <clears throat> you didn't wear time this well. Who are you supposed to be, Mr. Frilly Pants? You're going to be. <laughs> you're going to tie me a balloon animal. <laughs> I love that. You must be Bowser. I knew the moment I saw the flowing nubbins. You call arms. The flowing nubbins, is it because he can turn his on 360 degrees? I am the humble servant of Count Black. Master of dimensions, leaser of crowds. I am Dementio. Dementio? I mean, Dementio? It's, it's truly enchanting to find me, my hapless, my hapless victim. I have prepared a special morsel for of a tree for you. How about some magic? And Oila, you are now Dimension D, a dimension of my own creation. In this mind-bending realm, may attack, may attack start 256 times more potent. I am now more powerful. I can, I could obliterate you with the rays of an eyebrow. Now we must do it like two gleaming banjos on a moonlit stoop. Okay. Now, the ground pound, you obviously just double the damage, and since Bowser does double the damage... Didn't realize that was easy to do. Your blows are miniature jackhammers wielded by tiny angry road workers. 
How could this possible? This dimension makes me 256, 256 times more powerful. Whoa, you're such an idiot. I have to, I forgot the word. I forgot the word. Gruff, grunt, uh, not grunt, gruff, roof, I don't know. Whoa, you're such an idiot. This place makes me stronger too. simply an amusement that played out exactly as I planned. Were you amused? That was just a or the four. Or the four. What? Okay. The next time we meet, you will feast on a deadly eight course meal. And with that, my Dementia Limpho, I must say, ciao. Dementio? Give me a break. That's the lamest villain ever. Hmm. A little more, perhaps. They are strong, but they are beat. But they must be stronger yet to defeat Black. I must make sure they can't face him with the time comes at last. Here we go, back into the mission, okay? Brand new. Should be a... Uh, uh. Didn't even realize you can just push them back with just... Then, just ride on the wind, although switch to a different character like Peach, for example. Actually, hold on, go back. can show you the world Shining, shimmering, splendid Tell me, princess, what did you let your heart last aside? Okay. Anyways, um, forget about what I just said. Let's just continue on! Oh no, there's something back there. How can I get it? I don't know. Oh, it's just more points. I found this. Actually, I can't even get up there, by the way. I can't get up there because I need to higher jump. An hour in already. Not bad. Actually, an hour and ten minutes pretty soon. Oh, my goodness. This chapter is much faster than the previous one. Mario Peach and Bowser have scaled the tree and defeat Dementio. Or Bowser did. The exhausted heroes were relieved to finally see the ivory towers of Fort Francis. Was Tippy safe? Was the next pre really waiting for them ahead? Their only answers their only answers were the strangest voice carried on the wind from beside the fort. <clears throat> Three dash four, the Battle of Fort Francis. So this is where that dream Dweeb Francis lives. <laughs> what? What's this castle? Got over mine? Do you think Tippy's alright? I'm starting to worry. Oh god. <laughs> oh, <laughs> actually, guys, white words correctly. <laughs> Oh wait, yeah. <clears throat> I need nerd voice. <laughs> this is so high technical. 
It's a totally undiscovered digi butterfly species. No, I must document it. Oh, yeah. Yes, shake that. Whoa there, whoa, whoa. Don't let your kids watch this. The digi butter that no form now. Guys, will be so jealous when I post these shots online. <laughs> That's what I can think what his voice sounds like, like a nerd type. No entry unless you're a super genius like me, or you're a totally hot babe. Stay out. It's locked. Wait a minute. Here we go, I'm a totally, I look so hot. Look at my character. Okay, welcome back to this puzzle again. Okay, the port key to open fences store. I'm 100% total hot babe. Just look at her. Oh, save file. Welcome home, master. Is that a cat maid? Is that a robot cat maid? It is. I just discovered something back there. Well, I think it might be something important. Like, I don't know. Now, like, I know it because I played this game, like, multiple times. Welcome home, master. Today is the street date for the... Experience of the unicorn volume 15 do not forget welcome home master a baseball game in extra innings has delayed the start of starship x non i adjust the record meow the record of meow starting team by 30 minutes to compensate okay. i think it says <laughs> you can actually kill them like that oh you can't welcome home master a new space combat sim, Starship x non Space Bloop, has arrived by mail. Welcome home, Master. Today is the street... Okay. Wait for that one. Master. Yep. Alright, let's go. I have cow... I have... Collab 2, or Collab 2, I don't know, of all Master's comics and file them away. Do not think I did it out of the kindness of my rubble hot. They were beginning to clog vitals by escape route from the castle. And if you have Thorio, you can do this. Look at these cat bombs. First off, don't get yourself. That's what you're supposed to do for these guys. And there you go. Also, my character has low health. Oh no, now those cat girls. Oh, thanks. How's there a door up there? And why is it moving? There we go. Fight in the hallways. Stomping disturbs Master's nap time. Oh, wait. Wait, does it say it? Who keeps doors hanging like that? That doesn't even look right.
Okay, let's go to this store. Okay, pack tracking. Oh, look, it's another one of those, um, mall cops. Ooh, actually, yeah, eat this. Mmm! Oh, it's also in 3D. my next level up. Yeah, hold on. Try grind points? Yeah, I know that's not gonna, that's gonna take a while. Ow! Yeah. Ha 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 ha. Get back. Actually, we're getting close to level up, so it doesn't matter. Ah. Oh, wait, we need one of those. <laughs> oh, that's very high technical by the way you hear it. It looks like the, it looks like matri the Matrix with hacking. Come here. Come here. Ah, you think you're scary. I got you by head. Actually, are you the only one that's patrolling this place? Okay. You have reached the door to Master's private room. For security purpose, you must confirm your identity. Answer the following security questions was either true or false. Videos, video game soundtracks are totally high technical. Yes. Episode 127 of the Episode 127 of the Growers Chronicle is pretty much the sweetest thing ever. Yes. One day I will own all the Starship x Series 3 collectible action figures. Yes. Now you must enter the passcode. Blue? Oh. Meow. 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 You are not the master. Deploy security measures. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. I'm in prison. Ow! Oh, no. Hey, my health's back up. Oh, do you also have to- oh yeah. Forgot your bomb doesn't weigh absolutely nothing. Okay, here we go. Fort Francis, Fort Francis eyes only. Room on the left, two three two three. Did I say left? I mean, I'm not wrong because look, room to the right is supposed to be room to the left because his eyes are messed up like that. So room to the left, two three two three. Room on the right, two eight two eight. Okay, left is three. Oh look, another another one of these guys. Hey there, you seem friendly. If so, can you give me a hand? It's 
If not, give me a hand anyways. Oh, we need that. Freedom! Oh, finally, I'm out. I didn't even know what I could do. Thank you, thank you. I've been shut up in here forever. You never catch me in there again. I must repay you. I am not at your service. I'm sure you can use. I can. I'm sure you can use my talent. Hold on a second. Before we get all friendly, we should see we're on the same page. You met Francis, right? What do you think of the guy? Of your pers Of your first impression? Nerdy? Ah, I see, I see. Anything else about his catch your eyes? He has a photo fantastic. He's into butterflies. He's irresistible. He's into butterflies, just like that. Oh, yes. I see how you would think that. So, sum it up. What do you think about him? He's a monster, he's a tech geek, he's a stallion, he's a tech geek. So you think Francis is a nerdy butterfly, fantastic, basically a tech geek. Well, imagine that. You and I feel the same way about him. We got a great... Humanity. <laughs> Humanity? Harmony? Harmony. Yep, I think we work perfectly together. Nothing can touch us. I mean, I did say what, although, what he likes and stuff. Kiri is a hovering platform pixel has joined your party. On. Go back. The hovering platform pixel has joined your party. When you're riding Kiri, you move faster and can breeze over spike floors. With me, you can get places in a hurry. Go ahead, give me a spin. And this is why I like Kiri with Bowser, because it makes Bowser move quickly. Okay, 2-3-2-3-2-8-2-8. Okay, remember that. I can remember that. My game, thank you. Two three two three two eight two eight. I still remember. Ah, no cat maid. You have reached the door to master's super secret lair. Only masters allow inside. You must confirm your identity for security purpose. To confirm your identities, answer true or false to the following statements. Starship X Non Comics are never going to never going to be removed from their plastic sleeves. Role playing games should be no less than 180 hours long, not counting side quests. Fanny packs are both practi practical and stylish. Please enter the secret passcode. Welcome home, Master. Master's fantasy fortress is safe from intruders. Alright, a cat. Is Francis into cat maids? I mean, he has a taste. I can tell him that. Uh, okay. Give me this. Hold up your key. You got the four key.
Yo, what the heck? What does man have? Oh my! Oh wow! Oh no, he still did this guy. Okay, um, let's forget about what I just did for a reason. Okay, okay. Okay, yeah, we, okay, we already know these, yes, true, 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 no, into the passcode, too. Welcome home, master, secure meow, missed you. If you guys ever played the other two people Mario games, which I highly doubt, because much people watch it. These are these are these are actually NPCs from the game, including companions as well, with all the Yoshi's you can see. Oh, and that's Princess Peach up there. Kind of weird. This man has a lot of fetish into figurines and stuff. Two pixels now, and now for this part, after you get those two keys, guys, um, you have to switch to Peach for a purpose reason. Well, I will, I, I'm going to show you what happens if you don't be Peach. Well, actually, it doesn't matter how to be Mario again. This will, uh, th I'm going to show you what happens when you uh, don't be as Princess Peach for this part. Because I'm going to have it slim so I cannot get myself killed. Key accepted. I mean, key accepted. Meow. No, key, key accepted. Meow. Key accepted. Meow. Meow. Both keys confirmed. Meow. Wait a meow moment. You're not looking. You look nothing like Master. Only Master Francis and totally hot babes are allowed to enter. That's what happens if you're not Princess Peach. All others will get the kitty later. That's what happens, it just shoots lasers at you. 
Only Master Francis and Tully Hot Babes are allowed to enter. You can enter after I check to see if you're compatible with Master Francis. That is. Please answer the following questions with true or false meow. Video games and hot babes are totally high technical. Man with culture. True. If it's a limited edition, buy it. True. I have bought video game. I have bought games that I never play. Oh god, that hits. That hits very hard. True. If it got fierce giant robots on a giant robot combat, it is an insta buy. True. They are not dolls. They're action figures with real fire punching actions. True. <laughs> I have dumped a friend over an, <laughs> an argument about Starship x not propulsion technology. True. You just keep answering true for every single question in this. A sweet cover illusion is way more important than the storyline. True. Never pull the top copy of a pile of comics. Find them in condition one. True. Again, if these are hitting you, blame this. My first love was an anime character. Okay, man. If he has a man, if this is a man of culture, then sure, true. I love going on message boards and complaining about games I never played. True. Mrow. Nah, wait. Uh, nah, you start to be his peach. <laughs> Who are you? <laughs> hey, what are you doing sneaking into my room, huh? Have you ever heard of privacy? <laughs> oh, here you are, Francis. I've been looking all over for you. For me? <laughs> oh, 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 oh my gosh. It's, it's a totally hot babe. Oh no. <laughs> hot babe in room. I don't know. Code, code red, code red. What, what do I do? Oh man, a real girl in my room. This is so high technical. <laughs> but calm, calm down. I get, 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 getting way too excited. Yo, what do you mean? Which way you mean excited, man? Sweatless, sweatless. White lights, foam, foam, foaming. Can't talk to girls. Can't talk to girls. Must get my laptop from Frankie Pack. Booting up swoons.exe. Activating nerd to babe. Interface mode with real time wooing. Hey, yo. Hey, yo. That's sus, man. That's sus. Oh god. Welcome to my castle. How do you do? <laughs> what is this going on? What is this? I mean, what is this? Uh, what's going on here? <laughs> I boot this baby up whenever it's time to <laughs> talk to her. Uh, ladies. Sweet! Time for my swoon.exe programming to work. It's magic! <laughs> Where should I start? Speak. Talk to hot babe. What is your name? My name? Oh me. I am... I'm... I'm Peach. Tell me your name first. You can call me annoyed. Nah, man. I like... I like to go... If you guys know me, I like to go to good route first, then the bad route. Well, I mean, there's no route for this game, so... Let's go with... Let's just be friendly with him. Oh, me? I, I'm Peach. P 
Peach. Why, that's the name. That name is just Peachy. <laughs> I bet you never heard that one. <laughs> oh, I'm just drooling at the sound of it. Oh my goodness, this man's a. This man's weird. This man's sus. <laughs> you receive. Oh wait, no. You receive a straight answer. Pronounce his passions. Level up. Oh man, what do I talk next? What do I do next? Look. A favorite anime comic? You're so cute. <laughs> like a ton princess straight out of an anime or video game. You can be so feisty, but I must say it, it um, add to your charm. You think I'm charming? Oh, goodness. Hello. I am really cute, he. You're making me blush. I'll show you feisty. Hmm. Ah, right, let's play this one. Uh, oh, I don't like this part. I'm really that cute, he. You're making me blush. Man, just chill down. Just chill down. Oh my. Oh, and you smell so pretty. What an into? Okay, I don't even know what that word means. Into hyphenating fragrance. Francis is enchanted. Francis' stress level is down. Francis' passion level up. What's my next move? Inventory. Give item. Best. Oh oh. Francis peach sign poster. Pink peach. As my token of my affectionness. I like to give you a special present. <laughs> princess Peach received the pink princess sign poster. Oh, um. This is junk, won't win me over. I appreciate the thought. Thank you, Francis. Oh, thank you. It's gorgeous. You really like it? I knew a hottie. Oh my goodness. I, this is just so weird for this. Like you will pick it up and how premium this poster is. I got this baby at a totally high technical pink pitch princess anime event. Uh, oh my goodness. Why am I doing this? Okay. <clears throat> I was going to get CD, but I freaked when I saw this super rare poster. The voice actors for the princess and the director sign it, as you can see. As I'm quite sure you know the director changed after season 3, it's so rare. Mm. Plus, look here, the logo was done in extra premium gold holographic foil. And the paper, oh man, it's so UV resistant. You never have to worry about fading. I could stick on some backing board for you. How's that sound? Um, that's, yeah, sounds great. What is he talking about? Oh, okay, you got it. Let me just take this guy back for a few minutes then, okay? Peach returns to the poster. Francis satisfaction level up. Francis passion level up. Uh, what's my next move? Think about the future. Wow, we're going out. Wow, we are like so perfect for each other. It's destiny. We should get married. Look, married. If you, okay. If you would have me, let's take it slow. So how much do you make? Oh man, I can become a gold digger. If you would. Let's take it slow, buddy. Don't you think? Don't you think we should get to know each other before um, other, oh. <clears throat> uh, 
up, man. Why? Why am I doing this? Don't you think we should like, get to know each other a little bit first? Hey, who's making these responses for me anyway? I am not marrying this dog. I should have been having this conversation. I came to save Tippy. Where is she? Tippy? Hmm, Tippy, Tippy. <laughs> There's no Tippy command here. What is she talking about? <laughs> Pixels, Boomer, Peach use Boomer, Boomer explodes. No, my graphic cards. Finally, this dating simulator is finished. Jeez, it's so creepy. That was the only known copy of the Nerd 2 Bay patch, and now it's gone forever. <laughs> No, real babes are scary. Peach. Tippy. Oh, it's so wonder. Oh. I was so worried. You, you came to save me. So, so you come to raid my fortress to seal my fiance. Franchise. Sign. Well, no. I won't let you. By the way, I came up with the own franchise my own. Isn't it sweet? <laughs> At first, I thought it was a little weird that you could talk and everything. <laughs> but the Ditchy Butter Doctor form, form of reaction convinced me to me you were high technical. <laughs> you are my only <laughs> offline friend. <laughs> friends, Francie. So, no one will make it you... Crummy, is this, is this, no, it's not Francis. Crummy. Eek! Yeah, can't see me. That's because my invisibility powers are so totally high technical. <laughs> Little Francis is hiding so you can't take her. Feel the wrath of the Jilted x not in the season finale of the Grotters Chronicles. <laughs> Joke's on you. This babe is a fierce dragon. Or dinosaur. Alright, we're fighting Francis. And if you don't know where he is, you can... You can see that shadow on the floor. But I really don't care about seeing no shadow. Meow, bot. Come here, boy. Okay, I'm, I'm moving too slowly, that's for what. Unless I grab one of these. Yeah, okay. Give me one of them. I saw you. I saw you. And don't flashbang me. Boy. How the heck can he eat Bowser? This man has tongues. Taste the fire. Taste my flame. I think you jump over it.
Haha, <laughs> you missed me. Haha, <laughs> haha, suck it. Wait, what? Okay, if that's so, then just take Kiwi out. Alright, flat being me. Whoa, how does this man have the power of eating a literal... It's the, it's like about the same size as him. How's his tongue that strong? Come here. Yeah. You guys came to save me? Thank you. Thank you, Mario. I'm so happy. What is that? The beer heart? But how? It's like Tippy's heart just burst with happiness for at least a pure heart. Oh. Mario, I was just so happy when I just saw you that you come to save me. Please, take it. The Kirby song. <laughs> you got a pure heart. End of chapter! The fourth pure heart appeared in a dazzling flash of mysterious light. What may appear, the group was puzzled by this and many other riddles. So, you're not hurt, asked Tippy, full of concern. Somehow, Tippy seems different than before. She has started to change. Mario simply shook his head and started the long journey back to Flipside. Do you want to save your progress? Yes. Save and please do not turn off power. Save complete. And that's how... Oh wait, that's the evil. And that's how I reference managed to best me. Ha ha ha! They are very strong, to be sure. But they are strong, to be sure. Very strong. Dare I say. This might be the strong enough to defy a prophecy. A prophecy. Ah, oh, yes, Count Black. <laughs> Spell Count Black, your theoretics. Theoretics, the light prognosis is false. The dark prognosis holds the answers to eliminate heroes that rise to stop us. Oh my! That's the first time that morsel of information have touched my ears, do they? Hold out. Bleh! In two times, Demetrio. In two time. Oh. Oh, not to Not to see. Not to see? Oh, not to see. It is time we set him on these pests. Yeah, um... Can I take care of that for you, Count? Lovely, exclaimed Count Black. Man, don't do that point of view again. Return to your post, my dear minions. As your command, Count Hale Black. I, I'm not gonna do all, all those. Scott is Patrick. Um. Does something trouble you? Not the sea? Not the sea? I used to say that name. Oh. Yeah, Count. You know there's a strange time you can still change your mind? That is enough. Not the sea? Well, I come this far. So, we shall forge on. But you need stay back by Count Black's side. You can depart with my blessing. 
um, now, my count, I won't be doing that. My life is always sworn to you. Yeah, it belongs to you since the day you saved me. Hmm? I realize that. I've been sticking it out with you until my game's end, okay? If that plays you. My, my, how interesting that this is as a count and the count. Oh, wait, no, I think this is Dementio. My, 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 how interesting that is that that is a and the count have a deep conversation. Hmm, just what I'll do, count playing that. Oh, well, I'll let him worry about it. I must attend to my own projects. Timpany, why? Why would you avoid me? Ow! Ow! Unhand me! Huh? You're crying? Why? Timpany, you tell me what is happening. It's nothing. Don't worry about it. Just forget it. Oh no! Timpany, Timpany, is my father behind this? I'm, I'm just an owner. Can I go back? Nope. I'm just an ordinary girl. No matter how much I love you, we must part. Tiffany, I... This is a goodbye, Columbia. There is no other chance choices. This is our fate. That was a little weird for a while, but I seem to have gotten through it, okay? I'm so sorry. It was all my fault. And then, and then, you all. Thank you so much. <sighs> Want to know how to thank me, Bugface? Just stay out of my way, okay? Hey, come to think of it, Bowser, could you be our third hero? Ho, ho, ho there! I've been waiting for you, young heroes. Bowser, you're still on the naughty list. Ho, ho, ho! Did you succeed in your next search for the next pure hearts? I guess we did. Intriguing. Intriguing. So then, when you save Tippy, the next pure heart just appeared? Hmm. How very interesting. I think the castle was one of the dwelling of the ancestors. I guess that castle was one of the dwelling of the ancestors I told you from earlier. It seems that my ancestors have grown far and wide in their dimensional travels. Ho ho ho. In the castle beyond the great seas, we heard a pure heart and seal it safely. Yes, I remember reading a such a passage in the life of Augustus. The seal could only be broken by the powerful pulse of love and trust. So, you think uh, it was because Tippy began to trust us and we found this pure heart? That's amazing! And how? Are, and now there are three heroes. Ho, ho, ho! I don't know who the last one is, but there's no time in searching, my friend. Oh, please. Come on, people. Come on, people. With me here, you don't even need anybody else. Seriously. Trust me. Any problem come up, I'll stomp it into next week. I Bowserize it. Oh, ho, ho. Well met, Mr. Bowser. You... Oh, never mind. Can't read that. Okay, strength something. Oh, no. It seems the void has expanded once more. I'm in short. We have to keep going. We must start looking for the next hot pillar. There are matters I must attend to as well, like deliver more presents to kids and give them coal if they're naughty. I must search for any items of significance in the life of Augustus. And you thought that will be the end of the video. 
Well, jokes aside, you have to go back into this chapter for someone else. And you know who. Go back to 3-1. Now go back in this bush. Well, who now? You're trying to hear these three tips again? Just say the word. Can't you see? That's really not necessary. Why you already saved me? No more hints? No way! You defeat messes? Wow, wow, wow! So down, that's a huge news! I'm just glad I could help with that daring mission of infiltrating that nerd lair. So, uh, I guess there's no need for me to stay here and give out tips. I guess I've done my job. I have nothing to do now. Oh, hey, how about I tag along with you guys? Well, I made up my mind. Come along, whether you want me or not. Now, this is an optional pixel. You don't have to grab it, but it is pretty useful for some areas. Barry, the prickly pixel, has joined your group. Use Barry to create a spiky barrier around you. There's plenty of danger in wonder out there. Let's stick together. I'll be safer for both of us that way. And that's what Barry's ability do. You can use the return pipes to get back to Flipside from most places. But it's a one-way trip, so you have to hike back to the spot you used it. Want to return to Flipside, yes. And now, um... Jump off and save my game. Well then guys, that's it for today's video. This video was pretty sus, but um, that's it. If you guys like this video, make sure you like and subscribe and hit that bell to turn on notifications so you don't miss more videos like this one. Anyway, thank you guys for watching so much and I want to say goodbye.